Welcome back, everyone, and welcome back to Yakuza 0. Good to see y'all. Now, I did a little more grinding off-camera. Did a little bit more of the club minigame with some uh, helpful hints from our friend Mail Branch there. Thank you very much. Didn't get too far into it. A little bit into the first uh, Club Mara section. And mostly just bought the rest of Majima's abilities. There's actually not a lot of other side questy things to do. There is still the guy in the phone booth. I'm going to try to get a Chinese broadsword, see if we can get one from Dragon and Tiger. But for the moment, yeah, our next the next goal is to meet with the uh, corrupt detective who's going to take us to jail. Unlike all the other detectives who would just as easily throw us into jail. But anyway, yeah, we've got uh, some progress made in club management. Though presumably going to jail is going to put a damper on that at some point. <laughs> But let's stop in. That's right, I still have to send in a postcard for the stories we've been collecting. In fact, let me just, let's do that right now. Alright. Oh, I sure do. Come on, Majiba. Dig deep. I'm sure you've got some stories to tell. Alright, so we got the fake necklace, the street informer with the mime, for the pretend boyfriend, the Yakuza guy that had his face altered, the, the cult story, the guy with the bag phone, the tax man, the cross... God damn, we have, a, we have way more side quests on Majima than we do on Kiryu. Might explain why I haven't found any more running around. Aw, thanks, Octal. Very generous of you, very much appreciated. But yeah, any thoughts? Uh, what should we lead with, folks? What should uh, we send into Dolce Kamiya? Okay, okay, so there are select ones that trigger, that get read on the air, and there are ones that don't. Okay. I was wondering about that. I, was, I wasn't sure if it was like a luck of the draw thing, or if there was like a minimum amount of time you had to pass, or however it works. Yeah, we'll, we'll, do, the, we'll do the cult one. <laughs> the choice of... The time I joined the cult of Munan Choheptonas to save the girl got in too deep. Ah. Majima also doing some dramatic penmanship there. Huh. Yeah, four or six right answers and the rest aren't. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah, I got some big men to hunt for cash. Can you take care of this for me? Alright. That's a good girl. Thanks a bunch. Alright. Alright. Let's see if there's any, uh... Yeah, might as well. Why not? We'll take the club for a spin, then we'll go hunting for big men. So yeah, rounded up a few more of the girls we find around town, and a few more of the, uh... the point shrine recruitables. As you can see, I've got most of the Mars area potential partners covered. It's a little obtuse. Like with like with Kiryu and finding businesses, you sort of have to just shove your face to the wall and move until you find an interact icon. It, there's not a lot indicating the difference between what is and what is not a business you can recruit. That's kind of annoying. But honestly, on the whole, the minigame itself is actually kind of growing on me. Exactly, yeah. If you do the club right, they start looking for us. But anyway, yeah. Uh, let's... Shuffle the roster a little bit. Let's mosey. <laughs> In due time, man. In due time. But you know me. I'm a glutton for punishment. A weird esoteric setups that I can still manage to get working. Anyway. Alright. Hey, this guy wants to talk. Alright, that's a cool. For a change, you're up first. Work your magic. Do what you did at the street vendor. <laughs> Every now and then, you find a guy that's looking for that specifically. Okay, well, this guy's easy to please. Uh... Anyway, you go first. What? Oh, I think I picked the wrong one. Damn it! Wasn't paying attention. 
Yeah, it, it's crazy. She's got like max talking stats. It's... <laughs> yeah, I, I guess some people are into that. Oh, that's right, I can't swap them. Ugh, all the other ones are even worse. Shit. Okay, uh... Yeah, you'll just have to do the best you can. Yep. Alright, we have an issue. Towel, you got it. Yeah. Still impressed by the hand signal sting. That's a really nice little detail. That's it. Cough up the money. Empty your pockets, suckers. I own this town now. I mean, have a nice time, sir. Good luck, Shino. Yep. Alright, Ashtray. Done. Alright, All right. HP is low. Uh, Chizu, tag in. Hey, what you need? Oop, ice. Doing. Yes. I'm the best at host club whack-a-mole. Alright. Yuki, your turn. Alright, short session. That's fine. I'm curious under what circumstances you'd extend the session. I haven't come across that yet. I'm assuming that's more of an issue as you get as you get bigger. Okay, so they keep going when they run out of HP. It's just, yeah, they don't. They don't make as much dosh. Understandable. Yep. All right. Yeah, I'll try giving a gift to this guy. I don't even know that that does anything. I think it might. I think that might factor to the bill at some point, but it's not clear. Uh, Akina, perfect. Alright. What? Oh, shit. Oh, he probably wanted a long session. Damn it. That's what I get for jumping to conclusions. You can extend any session where the picture is in the bright pink happy smile. Got it. Okay. Duly noted. Oop. That's okay. Get back up. Oh, okay, okay. Different story. Right. Okay, everything seems okay. Gifts booster fan base. Interesting. Right. Just a second. Be right with you. And not a lot of options here. Uh, Chizu. Just stall for time. Alright. Uh, I believe that's guest class. Yes. Yay! Yay! One thing I'm just now noticing, you might notice that gauge is filling up by the icon of Majima. That unlocks a fun little mode that... Oh, towel, here you go. Yeah, that's basically a super mode. We'll get a chance to exploit it very shortly. Uh, Kirara. <laughs> Outstanding. <laughs> yep. Alright. Uh, thank you much. You know, the funny thing is, I've probably beaten up half the guys that have walked in and have walked in. Like, they're almost certainly some of the random encounters. Yep. There you go. All right, showtime. Sunshine fever, baby. Here we go. And my understanding is, in addition to coughing up extra money, the girls' HP recovers, and they can generally go for longer without needing to be replaced. Business is business, exactly. You know what? Hey, look, after failing to mug a guy, you're probably in a very bad mood, and you know you want to relax a bit. You know, have some nice company. So you go to the club owned by the guy that you tried to mug and, you know, spend a little money and let bygones be bygones. And you know what? Majima is exactly the kind of guy that would uh, let that slide. Yeah, exactly. 
Yeah, sorry about beating you up with a baseball bat in the alley an hour ago. Hope everything's square. Uh, let's see. Gotta go, there you go. Giving them expensive gifts. Got it. The menu. Might as well. Alright. Hey! Alright, now we're talking. <laughs> Alright, girls, 30 seconds left. Hustle like you mean it. Uh, Alright. Definitely, oh, yeah, definitely doesn't want the Ovatarian. <laughs> oh shit, damn it, wrong button. My bad, my bad. Okay, yeah, I can see that getting a bit expensive. <laughs> so yeah, that's basically activating your store power. Oh man, not a lot of options here. Alright, Yuki, just do your best. Only 14 more seconds. Alright, you got five more seconds. Make him count, buddy. Uh, Ume, stall for time. And off you go. And that's a wrap. Good job, team. Alright. So, yeah, as you can see, we're definitely making a lot more. We spent a fair bit on gifts, but we're starting to make a decent amount of money. Not nearly as much as we would be getting from, you know, hunting more Mr. Shakedowns. But if that's not your bag, you can definitely make a lot of money on the business side side quest stuff. And, you know, it is kind of fun to manage your individual staff <laughs> and slowly grow a fan base Hi. and do this little interesting side quest. Oh. Oh, we got some plot going on. What's going on, Yuki-chan? We got a challenge from Club Mars. Oh, shit. Looks like we're finally going up against them head to head. Wonder how that works. According to a challenge, according to the challenge, it says we fight it out in a cabaret club battle. Ooh, this will be fun. Cabaret club battle. What's that? No clue. Oh no, a cabaret club battle. Oh, Yoda ain't Yoda ain't a fan of this. What's the matter? Pull yourself together. You know something about this? Yes. It's Sotenbori's cabinet indus ca cabaret industry's rare but terrifying method for clubs to duke it out. Yeah, of course we're gonna get some, like, drawn-out, elaborate, anime-ass club duel between these two, uh, between these two businesses. Yeah. Running their businesses, determining who made more money. <laughs> yeah, I gotta add those in. I gotta, I gotta ask Eyes how he's got his set up. Those are fun. I want to get some chaos laughter going. <laughs> okay, so a cabaret club battle puts the club prestige on the line. The losing club will be branded a loser, and its reputation will be ruined. Fans will drift away. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I get the feeling we don't quite have everything we need to make this work. We'll have to... We'll have to level our team up. We gotta grind. We gotta hustle. Alright, so this is the battle so important it could shut down the whole club, man. Okay. Huh. Right, yeah, we gotta talk about that. Alright. Yeah, I get the idea. Okay. We lose here, it's game over. Understood. We'll do the Cabaret Club battle. We can't let the five stars continue their reign of terror. <laughs> I'm with you, brother. We're gonna take him to the cleaners. Just, you know, a <laughs> slight little nag, slight little snag in the plan. I gotta go to prison first. It's a long story. Okay, you can now choose the battle against Club Mars in the Cabaret Club Management menu. Got it. Right! So I'll have to mess with that at some point. But for now, there's other business to attend to. Okay, so you need gold girls in your main line. Level 20, holy shit. Yeah, you weren't kidding about that grind. Alright, well, let's put one of the 7 million we just made there. Actually, more like 5.8, 5 but who's counting? 
Ooh, okay. I don't know how good that is, but it looks fun. Alright, so Mr. Shakedown is this way. Let's see. We are going to want to switch up. I got a couple actual shotguns. Finally, my first zap gun. Hopefully, that'll be enough to wear one of them down. We'll see. Weapon Dude was holding out on me for the longest time. That Hunter's Village is its a good source of them, but you really have to run it again and again. And it was uh, taking its sweet time, let's say. Alright, so I believe Mr. Shakedown is coming this way. We're going to jump him. There he is. There's the man. Yeah, you can see the detective right there. Oh, man. Almost 700 million yen. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Right this way. I'm just going to let them slowly saunter up and, you know, size each other up. Oh, my. Two warriors meeting on the field of battle once more. I had a feeling you'd show up. Really? They don't do that much? I'll, I'll give it a try. A guy like you wouldn't understand. Why is that? Enough talking. When I'm done with you, you won't even have a pot to piss in. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so we can get this guy's story once we deal with him. Oh, shit! Ow! Damn it! Well, that was unpleasant. Right, we're off to a running start. Oh, Jesus, you aren't kidding. Look at that. Fuck, that did nothing to him. God damn it. Okay, someone explain to me why a slime shotgun does more damage than a real ass shotgun. I need someone to explain this shit to me. The accuser's weapon selection sits on a throne of lies. It's damage over time? But it, like, does damage instantly, is the thing. I don't know. I have qualms about this game. Okay. Alright, well, let's soften him up. Come here. Broken, huh? The whole thing is just in the damage value, it's still higher, so I'm not sure what that that value is supposed to represent. Like, the attack stat, I don't, I don't know. I, I feel like this game is just putting numbers on a screen, and I'm supposed to take it at face value. But anyway, yeah, we'll go to the zap gun then. Right. And we gotta make these shots count, because I've only got the one. Alright, easy does it. Oh, shit. There we go. Okay. Now ah, we're talking. This is some damage. Here we go. Maybe they... Maybe shooting up close will actually do more damage. Okay, no, that does dick. Okay, uh... Right. Let's try this, uh... Darth Maul-looking thing. Ah, fuck you! Oh... Uh, right, clearly I'm not a Jedi yet. Or a Sith, I guess. <laughs> hey, Kirby. Okay, yeah, there goes my money. And then what? Just spit it out. Okay, yeah, now we... We are definitely gonna need more... Proper firepower for that guy. So... Uh, let's see. Do I have the encounter finder on? I do. Okay. Maybe I'll get lucky and find a money dude. Or one of those gold guys. No, that's just one. I need real money. Amusingly, I did unlock the money transfer feature with that Elvis looking guy. There's like this long-winded 
like, kind of sort of weirdly grounded explanation for why you can transfer between the two. You basically find an investment partner, and he doesn't say it's Kiryu, but it's basically strongly implied to be Kiryu. And just like, yeah, for whatever silly businessy reason, you're able to transfer money and stuff between each other. Exactly, yeah. Need money to get guns so I can get more money. Actually, how much did that get me? Uh, not a lot. I'm gonna need to repair the guns as well. So, let's see. Yeah, I actually have to fucking grind in this game. Okay, there's... There's a patrolling dude. Not a gold dude, but he looks rich. Let's bug him. Oh, he's Yakuza. Perfect. Now I feel less bad about doing this. Yeah, I was wondering when that stuff gets unlocked, so apparently it's the business stuff that lets you, that gets it. Man. It's weird to have that gated by the minigame. Like, I can understand having the... Uh, that one style you were talking about, but, like, having a lot of mechanics behind what's otherwise mostly a side quest, I don't know. I find that a bit questionable. Okay. Now we got enough, now we got some walking around money. Okay, you get one entire section per fight style unlocked per per each boss in their business. Yeah, it's it seems like a lot of grinding to fully unlock the skill tree. A bit odd. I thought it had to do with something like I I thought it had to do with the individual skill trainers. That would make a lot more sense to me. All right. Oh yeah, I sent some. I sent one agent to uh, some secret factory or something. Alright. Yay, I got cashmere cloth. That's real helpful. Thank you. Okay. Alright. Uh, First, let's repair some stuff. Oh, shit! Oh, well. Well, well, well. Look at this. I must have overlooked being able to finally buy these goddamn things. All right, you know what? That's all right. We'll get the we'll get the money back the fun way. <laughs> oh god. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Somehow I missed the notification. There's a notification that says I could just buy those things now. I thought it was you find one, and I thought that was separate from being able to just buy them. Okay, that is that is much more convenient. Now, I do still need healing items. So, I believe the drugstore is down here. Okay, yeah, alright, that helps. That helps a lot. I, I was worried I'd gotten rid of something. Oh, you need this to... Yeah, you need this sword to craft another sword, and so on. This is, gets you the Turbo Ultra Ultimate Sword. Uh... Yeah, why not? Okay. We are covered. My revenge on the Yakuza is gonna have to wait. For now, I need revenge on the big man who took everything from me. All right. All right, back on the other bridge. Ready for our not quite final showdown, but close enough to it. Excuse me, sir. I think you have something that belongs to me. A lot of it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck, we're in tight quarters. Damn it. Well, we might be able to make this work, but... Huh? But, uh, be extra careful. Okay. 
Now, good news is he hasn't gotten all of his uh, health bars back. So, not the end of the world. Alright. Let's save ourselves some zap gun ammo. Oh, yeah, yeah. Healing would be wise. Good catch. Alright. There we go. Alright. Ooh. That pillar almost cost me. Oh, shit. Okay. Clothesline hurt. Fuck! Okay. Lesson learned. He one hit kills you with that. Motherfucker. <sighs> I've really got to start listening to those quiet nagging bells. Look, I said half the stream was going to be me trying to get revenge on this guy, and you know what? That's probably going to be a literal assessment at this rate. Did I mention I'm two days to retirement? Okay. He's up that way. Let's go. We have a date with Destiny. And this time we're going to pick it on a uh, wider stretch of terrain. You don't come at me. One bright spot is I did finally figure out the neck break move again. <laughs> the main problem was I didn't have the heat gauge enough. And there's a specific prompt while the guy's up. And I think you gotta get behind him first. Yes, here we go. Take a nap. Forever. <laughs> oh, that feels so good. I'd probably just kill the guy. Thank you, Kirby. Don't mind if I do. Alright. Thank you, Zero. I appreciate it. I'm gonna need the luck. Okay. Uh, Fuck. Right, that reset it. Damn it. Thanks a lot, Red of Encounter. <laughs> you could say I'm just looking for my big break. <laughs> I know it's a bit late for that, but whatever. Let's see, that looks like a recruitable girl. We'll deal with her in a bit. Oh, <laughs> I straight up knocked a guy over. That's great. Oh. We have a possible diamond plate situation here. We must intervene. Ooh, take a knee, buddy. This fight's over. <laughs> Seriously, he's, these are some fabulous bikers slash sanitation workers. Very vibrant colors. They'll look great at the morgue. Oh, uh, where's the other one? Right here. Oh, he wasn't dead yet. Yeah, seriously. Like, they're Like... You'd think if they were a gang, they would have some kind of similar dress convention or something. Instead, they're just kind of encouraged to do their own thing. Okay, he's back up there. God damn it. Yeah, sadly, the game doesn't let you pet the random critters you find running around. That's a shame, too. Excuse me, sir. We have unfinished business. It's round three. Yeah, it's a shame. Oh my. Alright. Okay. Now, let us take no chances. We will heal up to max. Alright. This time I will take chat's advice and stick to zap guns. If I had a little more courage, I'd try to finish him with the fish, but I've already lost to him twice. Let us not tempt fate. Damn it. Yes, absolutely needs more cats. Although apparently the bowling minigame has a chicken involved. And... I have no words for that. I, I That would be the least 
expected thing in this game full of expected things. I'm gonna have to investigate this. The chicken identity. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, man. I'm very curious about this chicken. Once we're back as Kiryu, we'll have to check the bowling alley out. Okay. We're getting there. A few more good shots. Oh, come on. There we go. Two more shots should do it. And... Oh, shit. Don't blow it now, Majima brother. There we go. Get fucked, sir. Yay! You really got something against me, don't you? Thing is, I've got no idea why. Just tell me what the heck's going on. Why do you need money so bad? It's not money I really want. Then what the hell? Okay, you gotta do his real estate stuff for the chicken. Duly noted. I will keep that in mind. Anyway, this guy, what I really want is hair. Say what? Hair? Ooh. You wouldn't know what I'm going through. You with your long, luxurious locks. Huh, good alliteration there. Hey, it's uh, nothing to pull your hair out over. Oof. Poor choice of words there, Majima. It's no joke. I'll kill you. Me and every other bald guy in Japan. Yeah, that was bad. Sorry. That's why I hate guys with gray hair. Always making fun of us. So, anyway, I don't see the connection between your hairy situation and beating people up for money. <laughs> oh. Majima is a fan for pun. Is a fan of puns. I, 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 I like him more and more. And it's kind of wild given the reputation he has in the later games and his presentation here. The difference between those two. Anyway, recently, we follically challenged men have been given to hope in the form of a revolutionary hair growth spray, available on the market in very limited quantities. Oh, hey, Ren. Good to see you. How's it going? Yeah, having a great time so far. I kind of got, kind of gotten, kind of got some egg on my face fighting this guy a couple times before, but we managed to redeem ourselves. Anyway, as soon as the wholesalers realized what huge demand there was, they hiked up the price so much it's insanely expensive now. That's what you need the money for? That's right, but then you got in my way. It's your fault if my hair follicles die for good. From where I'm standing, that ship has sailed. This is the end for me. My hair will never grow back. I'm almost starting to feel sorry for him. Almost. Come on, you don't need hair to look good. Be bold and embrace your baldness. You look fine. Huh? Uh. You mean it? Yeah. So you don't need to run around shaking people down anymore. It's the hair on the inside that counts. Wow. You know what? You're a pretty good guy. You just made me feel like a billion yen. Which, incidentally, is about as much money as I took from him. Which is a fraction of what that hair formula cost, but hey. Yeah, they were scalping you guys, but you're welcome. Thanks, man. Wait, scalping? Yeah, ripping you off. Huh? Why you gotta bring up my scalp? You're just taking another shot at us bull guys. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here we go. That, that ain't what I... And here I was thinking you weren't so bad. I knew I could never trust a guy with such magnificent hair. I knew it. You know, I think Oe has, like, kind of a weird man crush on Majima. And, like, this is the peculiar form of expression that it's taken. <laughs> you'll never feel streets in the you'll never feel safe on the streets, because I'll be waiting for you. I'll be shaking you down for cash till my hair grows back, even if I have to scalp you for a wig. Uh We were We were so close to resolving that peacefully. So very, very close, but one careless slip of the tongue, and now we have an enemy. Uh, we have an enemy for life. Oh well. We gave it our shot. All we can do is be ready for the next one. But anyway, yes, we have our money back. And let's see, where was that sword? Here we go. Okay, yeah, that's not too bad. I'll get you. Is there anything else? Okay, good. I can buy I can buy more fish. In fact, I'm definitely going to try the fish. Fucking broken. Yeah, yeah, look at this. The slime gun does 80. The zap gun does 90. The broken M1985 does 115. But these do like 
four or five times the damage to a Mr. Shakedown that this does. I'm not even... I, I, I have no words. Yakuza just makes stuff up as it goes. It, it makes up its own rules. Anyway, we'll send someone back out. Go! Different damage types. Okay, that, that kind of makes sense. That's not very communicated very well, I think. Th that might make more sense, yeah. If there's some kind of, like, extra effect that does damage in that, if it can't affect the enemy, does damage instead. There, there's something funky happening there. Anyway, howdy, Roku. Good to see ya. Yeah, I probably should have paid a little extra. That's all right. But anyway, it is... Whoa, okay. There's another shake down there. Uh, what's he carrying? Oh, look at this guy. 1.3 million. You know what? That's very tempting, but I've wasted enough time on this already. I'm just going to hop a cab to the other side of the bridge. Also, I literally have every single one of Majima's upgrades that isn't currently unlocked, so the money is kind of superfluous until I find something else to spend it on. Coffee machines, to be too coffee. Yeah, there are some... There are some coffee machines you find out there that do actually make a decent brew. Like, it's, it's not what you're going to find at an actual decent coffee joint, but... As they go, they're not bad. And and look, I'm a complete pleb when it comes to what I will drink. Like, I just, I will straight up just, oh shit. Oh, okay, I was worried the money didn't actually uh, get their atten get their attention, but we're covered. We're safe. But yeah, I'll drink gas station coffee. I'm not terribly picky. But yeah, I, I, I know what you're talking about. Those are actually not bad. Anyway, let's uh, talk to this gentleman here. Anta. It's time to advance the plot at last. うーん。誰やあんちゃん。俺はマジマゴロっちゅうもんや。あんたに頼めば、留置場の西谷に合わせてくれるっちゅう話聞いてのう。うーん。俺はどうしてもやつにおうて。オッケー、やめます。And all around just kind of creepy. Yeah, あんたも人手間省けるやろしな。うーん。潔いやな。せやけどそれだけで、よし案内したろとは言いがへんで。Good cup of coffee will get you through a tough day. Or it'll get me through a tough day. なんぼ渡せばええんや。いや、not for everybody. It's a kind of quiet day. 今の時代みんな金で収めようとしよう。どうなしたらいい。how much money you want? Because I did just get a billion yen off a guy. Majima, you done a just a bit of skill to get it. And that's the thing, yeah. There's so many varieties that. Hura, hune mo kita shina. There's probably something out there that would appeal to you, even if like you're not looking for like plain drip coffee or black coffee or whatever. Anyway, we're going on a river cruise. Yay! The smell alone can wake me up. Fear not, Fan. I will make it work. Fear 
あいつのことはよう知らんあんたはやつを古くから知っとるんか古いもなんもあいつがガギンゴロから知っとるわほう、はあ、西谷はどんなガキやったんや万引きのうまい赤ちゃんでな<笑>幼稚園に入る頃には釣りと置き引きも覚えとったの小学生でカツアゲ中学生で車嵐そんなガキやったな<笑>なんや想像通りやなその調子で言ったら高校の時には強盗でもやっとったんちゃうかベーキンは一つの人を見つけたことがあって、これはマジックの味がある。やつが高校の時やったな。えらい飛び級やな。せやけど、デカのあんたがなんでそないなやつの窓口なんかしとるんや。<笑>川底<笑> Okay, uh, well, that took a turn. なんやここは何の目的か戦時中に掘られた空間をわしが改造したんや。All right, when I was、まあ、we were talking about breaking into prison, a secret like getaway tunnel in the middle of the river was not what I had in mind. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the actual fuck? Like, we have, we have some blood sport stuff going on right under Sotenbori. What the shit? Yeah, they've done it so well that I had no idea this was coming. Holy shit! Yeah, I think someone's about to bust a deal and face the wheel. Why are they going to be able to do that? この闘技場で1年間戦うたらシャバに戻したるっちゅうどるルーラ一切見ろや卑怯な鉄道が相手殺そうだかもそしたら死に物狂いで戦うやろけどどんなやつでも毎日戦わせてみまず1年はもたん罪人同士で死刑を執行させようてるわけかゲスよ罪の償いと世の平和のためや。Yeah, it, この環境が何やねん。<笑>命がけた本物の名残合いなんてなかなか見れるもんやない。どんなもんでも珍しいもんには大きな金が動くってもんや。何が罪の償いや。金儲けやんか。めったなこと言うもんやあらへん。しがない刑事のささやかな副業や。There's nothing little about this, man. Seriously, like this takes God only knows how many people in on it. Like, I feel like I just got ported into a different game. Yeah, 
Okay, so yeah, we do have to win some Fight Club stuff before they'll let us go into prison. Seriously, that's gotta cost a pretty penny. And you know, keeping something like this secret when you've got like hundreds of people in the audience. Okay, well, uh, yeah. I guess we've got got to do some flight club stuff. Ooh, hang on a second. I was just about to ask why they let us wander around here. And here we are. Hi, Uhara. Nice to see you again. That'll be the motivation I need to get through this section. Yeah, let's do this. あ、ええで。3人勝ち抜けばええんやったな。そう簡単に行くとええけどな。ま、安城頼ます。It's <laughs> all good. I appreciated what you sent. Oh, come the fuck on. Look at this guy. Like, this feels like the kind of thing that would happen in, like, a Batman story or something. Or, like, a Bond movie or something. Versus Gara Majima. Okay, I think I heard you the first time, buddy. Ready? Yeah, yeah, we're basically fighting Cannibal Joker. Yeah, I mean, compared to what this guy's probably done, Majima is a saint. Well, we're off to a good start. Oh, it's a shame I don't have Kiryu. He can do his, like... He can do his, like, arm break move. Ow! It's alright, he apparently stabbed me in the kidney I don't use very much. Why not? It's even the odds are little. You're out of here, bitch. You like that? They let me bring weapons in too. Okay, I don't want to tell you how to do your job, but can I get a better name than the one-eyed monster? Just, you know, yeah. Oh boy, we get a doctor now. Doctor Kiri Hito! Alright. Apparently he's not that kind of doctor. Alright, there we go. Next match, fight! Oh, of course, he's got claws. Fantastic. And of course he's gonna surprise me with a jump kick first. Damn it. I keep overcommitting. I see that. You're sliding. 
I saw those feet, they weren't moving. The doctor is in intensive care. Come here. He's going into his super mode. Shit. Alright, come on, Majima. Get back up. <laughs> Ooh, got him in the backswing. <laughs> And the doctor is out forever. Ends up winner, Goro Majima. All right, that's two. Majima Goro, Nirensha. Masaka no tenkai ni kaijou wa kōfun no rutsumo to kashite imas. Shikashi. The one-eyed monster is making the crowd throb. Huh? Ho ho. Oh, this game is just chock full of innuendo. Oh, what the fuck? Tell me we're not getting a Mike Tyson XP. Okay, it's not yet. I was gonna say, after Michael Jackson, like, I, I am ready to expect anything. But yeah, no, we're just getting random boxer dude. It kind of has that look, yeah. It's not quite that. Yeah, it's more mixed martial arts guy. That is the stance of a boxer. Alright, you know what? We'll give this guy something closer to a fair fight. Oh man, I even performed a uh, counter in there too, it wasn't enough. Alright, come here. Let's see if I can finish this guy with a neck break. I feel like that would be appropriate given the circumstances. say after these guys after the mr. shakedowns this feels tame it's you know obviously it's a boss fight but considering he's not one-shotting me it's a lot less intimidating there's a lot less money on the line I imagine that's it give me that heat gauge all right now if I could just get behind him ah oh, shit I don't think it's letting me do it damn That's how the count works. Screw it. I was trying to get through it without it, but it looks like that is unfortunately necessary. You know what? Long as we're in here, let's try and finish him with the neck breaker. Yeah, there's no prop for it, unfortunately. No next snap for dead puncher. Alright, 
Good combo. <laughs> you might say his career has come to a rocky finish. Ho <laughs> You know what? After that, he's earned that cigarette. Congratulations! Guru Majima! Oh, hey, guys. Welcome to the party. Long story short, we're in an illegal underground fight club to you find a way to get into prison. Yeah, you have fun with your overly complicated illegal flight club here, and yeah, I have more important things to do. I'm going to prison. 